last year and uh, enjoyed it uh, and got motivated and got started and then kind of fell by the wayside a little bit. So I've come back this year uh, to freshen up and uh, to kick it off again. Uh, and I brought my wife and my son Toby. Unfortunately, my daughter couldn't make it. Um, but I, I really wanted the family to come so that uh, I can't tell the story the way Dimpler and the others tell it, of course. So uh, to have her understand why um, we all came along. And, um, and yeah, it's fantastic. I, the reason I'm, the main thing I'm like, I've actually done a few properties, but I've joined more for the um, be with the like minded and to have others to sort of bounce off and keep, you know, to keep yourself motivated. It's more about like staying on track or the like. So it's been years since I came to the last one and I've faded a bit, but it, but it is more the, the understanding, the, it's more the, for me it's the, you know, instead of just buying something, knowing that the manufacturer growth's in there, so you can then take the next step, take the next step, so you don't go three in and then get halted, for, you know, not being aware of what you should be doing. So it really is an understanding of the nuts and bolts um, that can help you sort of keep going. So that, that's the thing for me, that the nuts and bolts part of it, just to keep going and not, yeah, to get down the track and go have the finance person say, oh, we can't do it anymore because you're maxed out or whatever. Um, so that'll be the key thing for me. Many, many things, but probably that will be the key. Goal is like most people, passive income, because uh, I'm kind of out of age now, and I've had enough of work. I've still got a lot, a lot of life left and uh, I've got to stay fit and healthy and, and financial to get out there and do some stuff, you know, so now's the time. The kids are growing up, <laughs> well they're older, <laughs> so um, yeah, that, that's what it is for me. Yeah. We've sort of, even when they were little, had, bought, I had older places and done them up and bought a few investment properties. I bought investment properties years ago, I made the mistake of selling them, which is another reason for being part of here, you know, I had two houses in Port Hedland before it went crazy and sold them at the wrong time. If I'd have been in something like this five years ago, it'd be, it'd be so much different, you know, so if I'd have known all that time ago, it, it, the situation would be different now by, I don't know, millions. So uh, that's the thing, so the kids have kind of always been around renovations and uh, been trying to teach them the... Uh, the correct way to do things, not the, you know, go to work and, and not the way that I've done it, the way that I was brought up, uh, you know, bust your ass and, and carry on sort of thing. So no, they're very open, open to it. So, so I've bumbled along a bit before. I've always been pretty good at picking the property, but like I said, then, you know, I can get to it. Not having a, a, a decent end goal in mind that they've, uh, I've sold them and then years later, well, why don't I do that? It's only because I, I have no clarity. I kind of knew, I knew which, where I was going, but so I feel I'm pretty good at picking the properties, but all the other stuff, the timing um, and all the bits and pieces, you know, I, I, I haven't been that familiar with. So, yeah, give this program really is the thing 